evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to another episode of the Non-Cooperators, where we are continuing with Metal Gear Mobile. So, let us see what is behind door number one. Is that another? It's another node. I don't know. The 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 the, the, the computer that that's opened up right there. That looks like it's another node. But I feel like as soon as I pick that up, I'm gonna get ambushed. And we're gonna find out. I'm still in my my Kai. Uh, our, oh, hello, snake. Someone's trying to hack our uh, codex systems again. That'll teach uh, you to hand over frequencies over to every girl you meet. What the fuck? Otacon, are you okay? I was just... I'm fine, Snake. Please, try to focus. This is important. I can transfer the upgrade data to your nanomachines until I know it can't be intercepted. I'm going to have to use some strong encryption to stop them this time. Ow, oh, these things are hurting. My headphones. Frequency tuning time again. That's right, Snake. Scramble now. Oh, wow. Hello. Yeah, this one's a little bit difficult. Oh, yeah, we got it. Yay. A little difficult, but I, I got it. I got it. Okay, so now here we go. Uploading to... I, hopefully level 4 is the last uh, last level key card. I know usually the key cards go up to level 7, I think. You've upgraded your key card to security level 4. You should have full access to the base now. Okay, so... Have you been able to access any Metal Gear information yet? Some. Nothing exciting, uh, though. Dr. Reed told me that this facility isn't even close to the, uh, completing this, uh, this Metal Gear, and you think you should believe what you, uh, what that thing told, told us? Yeah. You're probably, you're pro yeah, you're probably right. Hang on, I'm going to try something a little different. If I use the password, uh, pa password data we've got from Dr. Reed, and, and combine it with the extra, uh, login information I got, when I shut uh, shut down the security net, I should be able to repath and primarily root a table and just do whatever whatever you're going to do, All right? Okay, here it goes. Beep, 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 beep. Oh my! What now? You need to see this for yourself. I'll try to patch it uh, through a big screen. That's not a big screen. Those are six screens trying to combine itself to three big screens. But let's see what it what it well, what uh, what we're uh, going to be seeing. Oh, it's got a load. It's an N-gauge. Well, technically it's a phone. Oh, it's bright. <laughs> Metal Gear. Metal Beer. Get over fear. Kamari Spear. Dragon. It's tear. Happy steer. Great Kinnear. Riding's a queer. Is that the new Metal Gear or is that Metal Gear Rex? I think that might be Rex, but that could be the new Metal Gear. I don't know. It could be, I could be sorely mistaken. Or it could just be the new Metal Gear remodeled completely after Metal Gear Rex. I don't know. But honestly, that they surpassed Metal Gear by using Metal Gear Ray. But then again, if we all know in the fight in Metal Gear Solid 4, Metal Gear Rex was actually superior to Metal Gear Ray. Not necessarily. It's you had an advantage because you knew how to use Metal Gear Rex, while Metal Gear Ray didn't really know how to use. Okay, Snake, it looks like they've got a fully functioning Metal Gear Rex down there. I thought you said this place wasn't fully up to running yet. I did. Well, that's what Dr. Reed told me. Perhaps we should stop relying on what Dr. Reed told us. Last I checked, she's not even real. This is a whole this whole situation's got a lot more dangerous. Why not pull out while we still can? I can't do that, Otacon. If this lunatic gets hands on the fully functional metal gear, who knows what damage could he, he could do? These guys dumped us into uh, these guys uh, dumped us into giving them access to the place. They're going to cut out uh, here and fully uh, fully operation metal gear. This isn't an, this isn't an intelligent gathering mission anymore. I've got to stop them. The only way to do that is to get down there and end this. So we go from uh, gathering uh, intel to... Now that that keycard has been upgraded, you should check out the armory again. I'm sure you have access to some facility. Uh, I have Look out for the shortcuts. Central control. Huh. So yeah, it's telling us to go back to the armory. If I... I don't know where the fucking armory is. This elevator leads us to the armory. I doubt it. Yeah, 
this battery is starting to get a little bit hot. I might have to take it like a long break. What I mean by a long break is meaning that I'm gonna have to play another day. But I really want—I feel like I'm getting closer to the end, so I wanted to see if I can do this all in one sitting. Because I've been, uh, yeah, I've been sitting here for about like uh, almost two hours playing this game, give or take. What? Snake, uh, looks like you're going to—you're going the right way, Snake. What do you mean? Well, the uh, the enemy obviously doesn't want you to go through this way. It looks like they're uh, separated the control boxes from the laser uh, uh, from the laser triggers again. They must be somewhere next to the uh, next to the room somewhere. You can destroy them by using a Nikita missile. You should be able to steer it through the air vents into the main sector of the room. Now you're going to a higher security le level. I'm sure you'll be able to find a Nikita launcher in the armory. Damn it! So we need to go through that door, and that door is... Well, okay. That's where the box is, which we need to use a Nikita missile. We gotta use a couple of Nikita missiles. How many lasers are there? Wait, one, two, three. There's three lasers. And we need to go through an air that air vent. Oh, you kidding me? I gotta... Yeah, get a Nikita first. Okay, so... I gotta backtrack all the way down to... I have no idea where the fuck the armory is. Damn it, Otacon, can you at least give me a map? I know, I, I feel like I need to revert back to my uh, videos and, like, map it, uh, remap it out there and be like, where the fuck did I come from from the armory? God damn it. It's all, it's, it's fine. I hope. Just backtrack as, as far as we can remember. Until some, something sparks. Some brain waves are still alive in there. Okay. Um, wait, wait, wait. So this is the level, level three door, right? I think. Hang on. No, it's not. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. Level 4 door, just pet cuts through here to this shortcut, to there, to there, cuts through here, and then we're out there. This is a level 3 door, and then we cut across to the, well, actually, it's this side. It's it's this side for you, for, for you guys uh, looking. Yeah, okay, there you go. Ooh, a lot of people, a lot of people. There is a lot of people. I don't like it, I don't, uh, you know what, I'm gonna have to just hang on. down. Goody. Wall, wall, wall. Na, 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 na. And running, 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 running. You know what? I do need to correct myself because I... Uh, oh, good. We're in the armory. I did pr uh, uh, previous men previously mention about my fa one of my favorite songs. Actually, you know what I should say? One of my favorite songs. That's what I did. One of my favorite songs from Metal Gear Solid, the franchise, is uh, the, the main theme. Shit. Main theme in Metal Gear Solid 2 that Harry Grayson Williams actually did. And that's really awesome. From the trailer. That. Oh, C4. Awesome. There's another version of that in Metal Gear Solid The Twin Snakes when you're actually in, ironic enough, when you're in the armory in this area uh, and the uh, other Metal Gear Solid uh, Twin Snakes, there's an armory just like this and if you go all the way down to the, yeah, if you go all, like, all the way down to the right corner in, the, in this room and there's like those laser, those laser trip, those laser sensors that'll just, if you just go through them, they'll just like set the alarm off. Go through them and just listen to the, um, the alert, the alert, uh, song, because that's like a modified- Oh fuck, I, see, I, I, I told you, if I run through it, I'm just gonna kill myself. God damn it. I'm a fucking idiot, I'm sorry guys. As I was saying about Metal Gear Solid with the music and everything, um, Go through those lasers, not those, but in Metal Gear Solid Twin Snakes, go through the lasers and this one, and uh, trigger the alert music, and it's like a modified version of like um, Harry Grayson Williams' um, uh, main theme of Metal Gear Solid 2, but it's like really, really cool, it's like all technified, and it's like... <laughs> 
But it's really cool. Um, you know what's also another a really good song? I mean, obviously the uh, the main theme in the original Metal Gear Solid game on the PlayStation or the uh, PSX for some people is the uh, the uh, main uh, the main theme for like when you when you get uh, uh, um, spotted or anything like that or an alert status. That's still a really good theme as well. So I, I like that one as well. Um, there's also the other one. Oh, he's still asleep. Good. There's also the other one. I'm trying to remember. In Twin Snakes, in Twin Snakes, Cycle Mantis is Cycle Mantis battle theme. That one's also really cool. But one of the best ones, in my opinion, is I gotta revert all the way back to like Metal Gear 2 Solid Snake on the uh, on the MSX. That was a really good song. In the beginning, it was like boom 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 now, hearing that in 8-bit, I'm sorry, 16-bit version, it's still it's still pretty cool. But I've heard someone actually revamp it to like a modern uh, version of it, and it actually sounds pretty fucking badass. And I was like really impressed about it. Let me get let me get my fucking camo shit. Re wait, whoops. Okay, revert. There we go. Alright, so let's see how this uh, Nikita missile uh, uh, works. Like, I don't know if like if I if I equip it and automatically it's gonna go into first person view or anything like that. I don't know. We're gonna find out. Right here. It's an automatic save, by the way. So I can't like call Otacon and be like, "Hey, Otacon, save my game." <laughs> that was my terrible snake impression. I've, I've been trying to do it all throughout the game. Leave me alone. Here we go. Okay, so. Oh, so it does speed up a little. Alright, so... This is a little bit interesting. I, this is, this is kind of cool, guys. I don't know. Should, I'm going to do it on my phone. I'm going to do it out without my phone. <laughs> Let me do it with the, with this screen, because I'm going to do it on my phone. Boom! I'm going to do it with, without the phone. <laughs> yeah, those turns are really sharp. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, that's one. Two. Hmm. It's so relaxing play with the with the Nikita missile. Curiosity, have you guys actually used the Nikita missile launcher for like anything else aside from doing stuff like this in Metal Gear Solid and Metal Gear Solid 2? I'm only curious. Like in um I'm trying to remember. There was one back there, I remember that. What I used it for, if I used it for anything else, aside from doing stuff like this. So I remember in the second one you had to do it for the pre uh, when you had to get the president, and in the f first one you had to do it just to shut down the um, uh, the electric floor. Yes, yes, the electric floor in the gas room. Oh fuck! I wasn't paying any attention. I'm sorry. Um, because I was trying to think what else I did I use it for in Metal Gear Solid in the first Metal Gear Solid. I feel like I used it. Oh, on Vulcan Raven. Really? That's okay. Whatever. Fuck you. I feel like I, I I I used it on Vulcan Raven. What the fuck? I'm gonna be running out of missiles. I know, but I know there's missiles in that in that cubby over there. Oh, locker, locker, you know, whatever. I I remember using it on 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 uh, Raven. Uh, hang on, let me just focus a little bit. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, okay, we're good. I remember using it on Raven uh, when I was running away from him and like I was hiding and I just used the missile, the Nikita missile. Obviously, if he sees it, he'll shoot at it. So I just got I got to do it when he uh, I got to sneak up on him and, and do it. All right, is that everything? Yes, it is. Awesome. Let me uh reach. Uh, let me just get more missiles and uh, I'll be all set to go. What do you want? All of the control boxes have been destroyed. You should have been able to get through the door now. Be careful, Snake. From what I can gather, no one has ever made it this far. Who is this? And where are you? It's like, wh where are you getting this information from? Snake, 
Are you talking to yourself? Anyway, you're free to pass through the door. Hurry. I feel like he's an AI. Oh, wait a minute. No, wait, 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 wait. I think I know what it is. I think we're playing a VR of uh, Raiden doing this mission. I think. I think that's what it is. Let me just get more missiles. There we go. I could be wrong, though. I, th I feel like this actually is a, can a, canning sto a, a canon story. I'm just, look I'm just looking around just to see if there's anything in the... F this door. Equip my SOCOM. I'm running out of ammo on that. Huh. Where's the box? That is weird that there's no box. No power box. Unless I passed right by it and I didn't even fucking see it because I'm fucking I'm an idiot. Holy shit, where the fuck? Oh, it's inside! I'm a. I, yeah, I am an idiot. Nikita, Nikita, Nikita. Here we go. 13 shots. Let's not waste it. Damn it! I say that now and I'm wasting all the shots! Damn it! Shots! God damn it! This is not easy, guys. It's giving me like really. Really, really sharp turns. Let me try to just. No, I knew it. I knew it. I fucking knew it. Shh. They're sleeping. What the fuck was that? <laughs> okay, so now it's. Okay, good. Now it's open. Alright, so what's in here that's special? Rations are full. We got more C4. I feel like the C4 is kind of useless at this point. Or at least in this game. For Metal Gear, goddammit. Alright, let me just. Heal up. Oh, fuck. Uh, no, 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 wait. Equip. No. Use. Good. Keep that out. Get rid of this so I can start moving around functionally. And let us continue next time on the Non-Cooperators with some more Metal Gear Mobile. Ready.